Hi everyone, it's me Jamshed Raza from ProfessionalTutorial.com and today I am going to show you how you can use your DSLR camera as a webcam and uh, we are going to use a third party software which is a paid version but we are going to use a free version as well and show you that how beautifully you can convert your DSLR camera as a webcam and you can use that in uh, Skype in messenger in a recording like i'm recording right now with my dslr camera and uh, that is quite simple and amazing now how we are going to do that and uh, how easily we can convert that one that is quite simple now for the software i am going to provide the link in the description of that video you can directly go and download that one and uh, after that one i will just show you here in my screen that we have like spark okay okay you are going to download that one and i am going to give you the link of that dis uh, that software in the description of that video and the installation process is very simple you are going to just click on next 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 and you will get everything ready and remember that when you are going to install that either you have like uh, canon nikon or any dslr camera it has a lot of uh, functionality which supports each and every dslr camera without any problem now after uh, now downloading that one you are going to start these and uh, you will get like a window like this one and uh, as you can see that we have Sparko cam and uh, I have a Canon EOS 550D which is very old camera therefore I'm using that as a webcam that is also the beauty of that video like uh, well, like we are uh, not going to buy a webcam instead we are going to use a dslr camera and a cheap dslr camera within uh, five uh, fifty bucks or hundred bucks you are going to get your dsl camera with amazing lens and then you are going to attach that with computer and you can record or you can call with anyone now you can see that we have uh, amazing uh, like uh, functionality all of the functionality are there like you have a canon camera i have right now a canon camera which is attached with that one and if you have a nikon camera and uh, you have webcam desktop there are, are a lot of functionality but remember that it is a free version like we have to buy to remove watermark and you can see the watermark as well and uh, i can also assure you that it is not uh, really important you can just uh, remove that uh, watermark but uh, but if you want to use that for commercial uh, purposes or if you want to want to just contribute to the developer you should or you must pay um, maybe it is 30 or 40 uh, bucks you can just pay for that software and that is amazing but if you are not going to pay and if you want to talk with someone with that watermark you can do that as well but uh, as i can uh, you can see that i am using right uh, let me just minimize that one obvious and uh, for obvious you can if i'm going to go into sparko and you can see that i have a watermark like here but i have just removed that watermark and uh, without uh, now that is the free version which i am using right now and uh, but it is quite amazing that without uh, without just visibility of that watermark i can just record and i can just uh, do whatsoever i want with that vacuum and uh, that is how simple you are going to do that if you uh, some people are just worried about that if we are going to connect our dsl dslr camera and uh, we want uh, that to be used in skype uh, you can also use that one as well now let me just show you how you are going to use that okay uh, for example i have like like uh, Camtasia and if I'm going to go to the record and you will get like uh, the panel this one and you can see that I have camera and it is a webcam now because DSLR camera will not detect it by Camtasia directly uh, now it is detecting what we have like uh, Sparko cam now you can see that the watermark is on the top of my head and here some somewhere here and um, therefore we, the, therefore you are getting like uh, uh, watermark as well but you know 
with the proper editing or with <laughs> proper cutting we can just terminate and remove that watermark but i don't recommend that you have to buy that software it is very beautiful and the link of that uh, software is in the description of that video uh, okay everyone i hope you like that video and uh, that is quite simple if you like that video and if you want to just contribute to my channel just please thumbs up that video and also share with your friends if you have not subscribed yet subscribe my channel for more amazing video thank you everyone goodbye god bless you